Are you struggling to find new real estate clients in your market currently? Well, I'm going to show you step-by-step how to set up Facebook relocation ads that could potentially unlock a new client for you that's going to lead to you actually hitting your real estate goals this up and coming year. I feel for every single real estate agent that's out there right now, I know how tough the market can be right now. Every single market's declining sales massively, and it's going to be a tough next couple of months and potentially years as being a real estate agent. But I'm sure if you're watching this video, you're like me and my team, where we're super ambitious on getting better each and every year. No matter what's going on in the market, there's still homes being sold. We just have to find a way in order for it to be us that's getting these sales. And these relocation ads can be the secret for you to unlocking a different market, but actually still having success on who doesn't actually care about high interest rates and property prices. If you're tapping into a different market where prices are substantially higher and where people potentially are looking to relocate as things in the economy aren't doing as well. Hey everyone, it's Russell Mortlock here with the Apex Group. Got some valued content here for you folks on how to set up these relocation ads. It's gonna be step-by-step on Facebook. This could be the difference from you not having a good year to potentially beating your sales numbers that you did last year. So for me and my team, our sales continue to increase as the market declines, and I want you to be a part of that. So I'm going to explain a little bit from the mindset of what these relocation ads are meant to be and who they're going to be targeted, because that specifically let everyone know you may not be in the right market for these in order to happen, but this could just be something that you can tap into that's going to allow you to have success. So what you're shooting for is a mark that is more expensive than what you currently sell. For me, I'm in Kelowna. We get a lot of people that relocate here from Vancouver just because of the price discrepancy. So in Vancouver, the average single family home there costs 2.1 million, where if you come down to Kelowna and you spend 1.5 million, these people are going from having maybe a thousand square foot condo at 1.5 million to now be able to buy like a 4,000 square foot brand new home here in Kelowna. So this is a really good target. And because we potentially do get so many people that are sick of Vancouver in terms of the traffic, the busyness, uh, how much real estate prices cost, the rain, they want to come and enjoy the beautiful Okanagan weather and upgrade their home, especially in the world where a lot of people are able to work from home, they're able to work anywhere from the world. This has been a really hot niche on targeting these relocation people. And my team has been very effective doing this and it's equated to a lot of sales. One disclaimer too, these leads are going to be a bit more expensive than other Facebook leads that you have because you're more generally targeting people just because you are kind of putting it out there and it's going to be a little bit more general in terms of the information. So they are going to be a higher cost per lead, but can be very, very effective. Another example of how this might work in someone else's market is say if you sell in Calgary, you could target people who live in Kelowna that if they sell their home in Kelowna, that's average $1.2 million. You could buy the probably one of the nicest houses in all of Calgary and have potentially more opportunities moving to a bigger city. Uh, so there's always different markets that you can play into this so you can evolve it. But once again, this has to be specific to where you're selling and this may not work for everyone. But if you're someone that thinks this might work for them or you don't quite know, but you want me and my team to start running all your Facebook ads, we'll go in the description, fill out all the information. We'll see if this potentially might be a right fit for you in your market uh, in order for you to start having success from these ads. So let's break it in step by step how to set up relocation ads on Facebook. Okay, so step one is you do have to have an ads account. And for people that aren't even there yet, go back to some of my other content. I'll show you exactly how to create these Facebook ads. I'll show you exactly how to create your Facebook ads account and your Facebook page. But let's hit create here. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to want to be generating leads. Campaign name, we'll call it Relocation Vancouver. If you've watched a lot of my other videos, you definitely realized that I rely heavily on spell check. Don't worry. The best part about Facebook ads is you don't have to be a uh, copywriting genius. You just have to know what pain points people want to hit on. Uh, so real estate, we are in the special ad category, which does suck because it limits our targeting. You're going to be running ads within Canada. All this other stuff you don't have to mess with here. We're going to be wanting instant forms. I can't stress this enough. Make sure you have good systems of running these Facebook ads. I know so many people are like, oh, it was a pain in the butt having to export all these contacts in order to follow up with them. When really it's a small fee to get a good CRM like Fallout Boss or Real Geeks, where you can just have all these people seamlessly with Zapier or whatever software that they have instantly go into your CRM so you can call people. Like which Facebook page you'd like for it to come out. 
Uh, this is our real estate one. Our performance goal is maximum number of leads. You don't have to mess with this. Don't mess with cost per result. Let Facebook work its magic. Your budget and schedule, I recommend you always want to spend around $20 a day. But here's the nice part about advertising on Facebook. It is the cheapest form of advertising that I've came across of about all the online lead generation. Having a $20 budget should be sufficient to get you enough leads. And if you aren't getting enough leads, I'm sure it's probably something to do with your ad setup. Start date, end date. Uh, this is something that I don't typically mess with, but if you're someone that may forget about it and you're going to want to hit an end date, but I want to tell everyone right now, you got to at least run these ads for a month in order to get the data to see how they prefer. Budget scheduling, don't mess with that either. Create a new audience, you don't want to mess with this stuff either. Create a new audience, uh, doesn't really applicable now. Say if you're getting a whole bunch of interactions and you have a bunch of people that you know are from Vancouver and you make a custom audience, well, then you can run some retargeting ads to them. Here. One thing you do want to change is the location. So I'm going to be doing Vancouver. You can look up the other cities. So you can do like Burnaby, Delta. There's a few other ones that are applicable to. And here we want to do manual placements. This is super important. Advanced placement recommendation does not actually work better for your ads. So we just want Facebook and Instagram audience networks. We don't want. We want a Facebook feed, Instagram feed. Don't want Facebook marketplace. Facebook video feed, explore homepage, all that stuff works. You can test some of this stuff here too. I typically eliminate search results, but you can see if these ones all perform. Okay, next we go on to the ad need. If you do plan on iterating on this and doing some other stuff, so Facebook relocation, identity, you want to make sure this is coming out of the right Facebook page and the right Instagram account. We're going to be doing a single image and video. Okay, let's go to ad media. So one thing people really need to realize is all these images that I've generated here is I made these using AI. Um, so talking about our ads, we want to really call out to what the consumer is. So sick of living in Vancouver, relocate to Kelowna. So we're highlighting on a major pain point and then we're talking about where we want them to go. But I made these images, I made all these ads in AI and it took me less than five minutes. Absolutely mind blowing how well artificial intelligence is assisting people in their advertising. So if you're someone who wants to learn how to elevate your real estate business using AI, well, go to my Instagram and send me a DM and I'll shoot you the link in order for you to be a part of the AI. I'll get back to you on all the information and the best tools that you need in order to level up as a real estate agent. Okay, so we want to upload the image here. One thing I really want to stress is highlighting major pain points. Like a lot of the people that I've helped move from Vancouver, they're just like, I'm just sick of living in Vancouver. And I want to relocate to Kelowna because of this, because of that. And it primarily leads to a few reasons. So you want to call out to the audience and then tell them where you want to go. Okay, so now we're going to be designing our ad primary text. Okay, so considering moving to Kelowna, find a list of homes under 1.5 million. So that's a really niche market. We found a lot of the people that relocate to Vancouver, their budget's around 1.5 million. In order to get into the single family market in Vancouver, you need 2.1. So this is a very targeted and specific to what the consumer may be looking for. Least upgrade your home. This is a great point because a lot of people go from living in a condo to now they can move to Kelowna and be in a 4,000 square foot home. You want to turn this to learn to more. So destination, we want to create a form here on where they're going to go. So I'll call this relocation Vancouver. And you're going to be wanting to go for more volume, higher intent. I don't think it's actually as valuable as people may put it on more volumes when you want to be looking. So intro, we're going to use the image from your ad. Let's fill out a good headline. So yeah, we want to hit on major pain points there. Find homes half the price as in Vancouver, but double in size. Contact fields, we're going to add phone number. So we're going to go full name, email, and phone number in description here. Privacy policy. So let's go to your website. You can visit our website to see how much better of a home you can get in Kelowna. View website. I would probably change this to view list. And then add link. Okay, so let's go to here. We'll refine it. So let's go home. Let's go under 1.5 million. Let's keep it between the million dollar mark. Let's go four bedrooms. Let's go minimum square feet. Let's go like 3,000 just to be specific to people here and we'll go search. So right then and there, these people can see like you're going to get a beautiful home compared to what you can in, in Vancouver if they're to relocate here. These are great ads in terms of thinking about who potentially is going to still be looking for homes when the market's not good. A lot of these people, even who are living in Vancouver, might have to downsize or sell their home there and end up relocating to Kelowna. So it's just an extra layer. They're going to be people potentially buying who have a lot of money from the sale of their home and are relocating here. And they don't really care about interest rates because they're buying in cash and then play it on where 
yeah, they don't really care about interest rates either because if they do have a lot of money saved up, they're getting a way better home than what they're used to living in Vancouver. So they think it's as they're upgrading their life and getting closer to what they actually want. Uh, then you just hit publish. Perfect. So yeah, that's exactly how you set up those relocation ads uh, on Facebook step by step. Please test this out and see exactly, like I said before, these are going to be a higher cost per lead and they potentially might not work in every single market. But if you're someone that wants my team to start running all your Facebook ads and your marketing, reach out to us, go in the description, fill out that form, and we'll see if you're a right fit. But if you're someone that wants to elevate your real estate business using AI tools and you want to see how I'm using it to design all these ads, I'm using it to create all the beautiful images that we use to have our ads perform top notch. Well, then go to my Instagram and shoot me a DM saying AI provide you with all the tools that you potentially need to elevate your real estate business.